Mm-hmm. Well, the the first thing we usually do is that we look at ourselves, we look at Frank, and we think to us, like that's what we did with with Pasha. We thought, hey, he's a great athlete. What can we offer him? Can we give him enough value? Value that he will be, that we feel excited and stoked to bring him on the team, because we were looking at a lot of other teams who bring on five, six, seven, eight people just because their name is is growing right now in the community and kind of want to feed off that. And we felt like, hey, if we want to bring somebody on, we really want to offer him something, whether that's exposure or or financial. Uh, payment to make it easier for him to focus on his training. So that was always the first step for us is to like, hey, how are we doing? And can we even afford to bring somebody else on? And then it usually picking the athlete comes down to to a number of things. Obviously, skill is a factor. We look at, hey, how good of a free runner is he? Do we feel like he has a unique style that we enjoy watching? Do we think he adds a style and a type of movement to the team that we don't have yet or, or don't show in that way and does he make like can he stand by himself as an athlete in the worldwide community other things we look at is just if he's a cool guy or not do we get along with him then there's a lot of other people that we think are amazing cool guys and we love hanging out with them but they wouldn't necessarily work in a sense of a, a team member that we work with every day mm-hmm. And then it really comes down to nowadays, Frank is renowned for making videos and making content and photos for a, like whoever we bring on has to have almost a passion to do that. Yeah. Or if not, he needs to have a passion to bring something else to the table outside of being an athlete. That could be doing blog posts or even just maybe he's really passionate about making events. I don't know who we'll bring on in the future. And that could even change. Like at this point, we really want to bring on people who want to do other other parts and other work as well. Hopefully later we can support somebody just for being an athlete. Yeah, that's awesome. Is there any specific benefits um, that you guys have written down or anything like that? I think we definitely, we're definitely very clear with the people who we bring on that, hey, this is what we want to offer you. This is what we want to give. And I think the first part of that is that we say, hey, we want to give you monthly payment for being an athlete, for putting your time towards Farang, and we want to honor your time. This is not a payment that any big company or brand can give you, but it will help you get by with everything else you're doing. Yeah. And aside of that, I think we always try to bring as much value as much benefits as possible outside of that and that can be anything from making sure like hey pay attention to your instagram do this let me post a photo of you and push some followers your way like as soon as we really say hey we think we believe in you Mm -hmm. we're working towards the same goal and we have the same vision We'll do everything in our power to help that person out, to get there, to stand by themselves and to build their own brand.